Everybody, what's going on? Les are back again, and I'm going to do something a little different today. I'm going to be reviewing a vinyl, specifically the Iron Giant soundtrack by Mondo. And the reason I'm doing this is because when I purchased this, I could not find a single video on YouTube talking about it or reviewing it. And really, I couldn't find a whole lot of information about it on the internet either. All I really saw was a bunch of copy and pasted text from the Mondo website. So I figured I'd remedy that and you know, possibly help out anyone looking to buy one of these in the future. With that said, let's get right into it. I don't think I need to tell you how awesome the cover artwork is, so let's get right into it. Here inside, we got that great scene with the giant and Hogarth in the car. Back here, we got the scene with the deer and the track list. And this is the full soundtrack. I've confirmed that. And now we'll get into our first disc out of the two of them. It's the vinyl itself. And back here, we got this little piece of artwork they included. You know, the giant the snow at the end of the movie. And back on the back of this is, you know, just a credit list. You know, composers, uh, performers, producers, that sort of thing. And copyright Warner Brothers and Mondo. And here's the vinyl out of the sleeve. Now, if you guys are going to take anything away from this review, take this. I was lucky and I got a grave and I got a set of gray vinyls. If you buy this, there is no guarantee that you will get a grave vinyl. It's random. So if you buy one of these soundtracks, you get it and the vinyls are black, you know, standardly, don't come crying to me and get mad at me or get mad at Mondo. It is random and I was just I, I was just lucky for once. So with that said, let's have a listen to a little bit of this. And one interesting uh, thing about this record that I forgot to mention is that it's actually meant to be played at 45 RPM. So let's show that real quick. Also, please excuse the amateurness of the Crossley. I'm working towards getting a legit turntable. If I do, I'll try to post a video showing the difference between sound quality and play a little bit of this on there too. So that said, there we go. Wow, that's terrible. Now, I don't want any copyright notices, so I'm unfortunately going to have to stop there. But what I can tell you about the actual soundtrack is it is the same one they use in the film and it sounds really clean and crisp and clear and has very good quality. I wanted to show you guys the back of disc one where we got the giant's head here. Also on the back of disc two we got the, uh, the giant's jaw bolt that is, you know, iconic. And that's about all I wanted to cover. I would definitely recommend this album to anyone who has a record player and loves Iron Giant or just loves film soundtracks for that matter. It is really awesome. I love it. It's definitely the pride of my very small vinyl collection and I imagine it will remain that way for a very long time. So if you have any questions or anything I didn't cover, feel free to ask in the comments. I will answer them the best I can and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.